It's 2006. I've been working with Richard Kraft for 17 years. And here I am, waiting for him to call with my latest scoring assignment. You know, it wasn't always this way. I used to be hot in the 90s. Ah, I can remember it like it was yesterday. When a conflict comes my way, I tell my agent what to say. My schedule won't permit, but still, if it sounds like a hit, he laughs at my duress, then turns around and always answers yes. Though it's clear I'm blank and spent, he's thinking of his 10%, so though I'm on my knees, he turns a deaf ear to my pleas. My marriage is a mess, but still my agent always answers yes. I complain, the schedule is inane. The blood has left my brain. Sandy de Crescent thinks we're both insane. And boy, she's right, cause I've been up all night humming with all my might. <laughs> A score that sounds just like the one before But as I finish the last chord The preview cards come back, they're bored So they postpone the scoring Maybe three weeks, maybe four I look up from the floor And hear my agent telling someone Yes, he's free And by the way, I've raised this fee Oh God, I've barely time to pee I guess it's a success Yes! He'd rather have anal warts than lose a job to Gorfain Schwartz. He'd rather fuck a pig than see James Horner get a gig. He'd rather wear a dress than let another agent answer yes. He makes me feel like a dunce because I can't write two scores at once and I won't work in groups like Hansi Zimmer and his troops. I'm yelling SOS, but still my agent always answers yes. You know what I'm talking about. For a deal, would Richard miss a meal? Oh, come on, let's get real. He'd rather lose his shirt than miss dessert. So when his bank book gets him down, I get an elfman hand-me-down. I really must confess he won't impress with his finesse. He don't know more is less. He can't suppress the need to just be yes. And so, as long as there's a movie show produced by some defenseless show, I'll never convalesce. Yes! But